Hey, would you like to come to the most beautiful family-friendly festival you can earthly imagine with a stunning creek coming straight out of Yangla National Park <laughs> in the back? I was sold straight away and I was here three months later, Daniela highly pregnant with our youngest one and, um, and we loved it here and we have been coming every single year since. Yeah. And then obviously progress into store manager and bought this property with other people together for the festival so that they could camp on there. Never planned actually to live here, absolutely never. And then when COVID hit, we got stuck in Germany. And we decided, yeah, that's it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And so then, when the summer came, we thought we have to get our kitchen off the ground because it's like we, before we had our kitchen in the trailer out there. Mm. And so we, sometimes we were cooking in this, standing in this deep water, and things like you know that's not much fun if you do that all the yeah. time. So then I built this. And so for that, this is the oldest building of all of them here. And, uh, mm. yeah. <laughs> and you have all the homeschoolers here as well. Oh yeah, we get like we get yeah during the festival we have all the homeschoolers camping here and and then everyone uses the kitchen, which is really nice because whenever you come, there's always someone here, mm. so it doesn't feel empty because otherwise, like it feels a bit abandoned during a festival. Yeah. You know, everyone's listening to music or so. But, like when you have enough people, there will always be someone here. Mm. Mm. Yes, I like my coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I have to say that. <laughs> so you brought your music. You brought your music to the festival. You brought, when you first came. You were doing. Oh, I was doing instruments. instruments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had the stall. I was doing instruments and um, like jam bass and and violins and harps and shakers and you know all the all shaker eggs whatever like whatever people wanted to buy yeah. or ukuleles at the beginning i remember, I remember yeah yeah yes. and you know the ukulele stopped you know you know how it used to be like i don't know how many years ago um everyone played recorder at school yeah and then they changed that to ukuleles mm -hmm. that's when my ukulele sales stopped like the little cheaper ones for the kids yeah because everyone didn't like it anymore because I had to do it at school. Yeah. And before that, it was special. Oh, a small guitar, perfect. I can busk with that. And so people earn money here, like with the ukuleles and everything. Yeah. It was really beautiful. The best sale I ever had, this young boy came, he wanted to buy a blue ukulele and his mother said no. And she said, I buy you a harmonica. And so they bought a harmonica then he bust all week and long with a harmonica until he had the thirty-five dollars for the ukulele and came and bought the ukulele at the end of the festival. And in all subsequent years, I've seen him slowly growing, 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 and always busting with the ukulele. Then later with the guitar, I don't know his name and everything. He must be like eighteen or nineteen now or something like that. But that's one of the most beautiful stories. Yeah, and um, that's a beautiful story. Yeah, I love that, and but now I don't want to have a stall anymore. It's like I do the repairs for musicians when they have an mm. emergency or anything, and um, I have my workshop and here you're on the still, truck. You're still making instruments. Yeah, yeah, I make yeah. instruments. I repair yeah. instruments, and more than in a long time because Ruben is my apprentice, my son, my yeah. oldest son, or my only son. And um, he's my apprentice, and so um, we work actually a fair bit up there. Not today, though. No. Oh, actually, I work there later, but I have to do bookkeeping. Not bookkeeping, like um, email stuff. Yeah. You know, that kind of work needs to be done, too. <laughs> so how was your festival? How was it was good. I, I really, really enjoyed it. I was very, very busy Thursday, Friday. Friday, camping people in. So, you know, I love to build a connection with every single camper. So I actually, every single camper who was on here, I, I greeted personally and asked them to select a spot. And then they went there and they built up their camp and I showed them all the beautiful trees we planted around there and everything. You know, as I, today I came and someone said to me, um, oh, you know, it's like we protected your pawpaw over there, but you should really pick it because if you don't pick it, the animals get it. It was one right pawpaw. It's like, you know, on any other festival it would have been gone. 
but it was actually still there after the festival waiting for me. Yeah. Which, isn't that beautiful? Yes. Yeah. There's no plants damaged, nothing, yeah. nothing, everything has been looked after. And, um, and that's one thing I really, really like. And that's another reason why I actually bring people in. Yeah. And yeah, and then Friday I was, um, yeah, that was Friday I was busy with that. Before that I was busy with the stores. And then over the weekend I only listened to music, looked after the compost, and, um, and I loved it. It was beautiful. It was fun. I saw you getting past with the compost. Yeah, and you had a good festival too? I've just yeah. had the most amazing festival. Yeah, it was, yeah. It was wow. stunning, wasn't it? Yeah. So many special moments and yeah. tears and yeah. gatherings yeah. and yeah. Yeah. healings. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, no, that's really good. Yeah. The dancing spiral was really special <gasps> yesterday, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. It's like sacred geometry. Yeah. Being in the centre, I just I was like, yeah. whoa, that spinning was, yeah, and spinning. Yeah. 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 I was a bit worried for, for Linda in between because I she, don't know how frail she, she is. She was, she was really well supported. Yeah, and that's, that's what exactly, I thought. Yeah. Like, yeah, that's what I yeah, thought. Thank you, yeah. yeah, yeah. I was just yeah. sort of like that. Just like beautiful. Yeah. yeah. And so good for her that she can still come. Yeah. Yeah, well, lots of special moments. So, yeah. what's another special moment you've had? You know, I just loved the stage presence of Salt and Steel. Like the energy, the stage present. The music is actually not my favorite music. It's like, I, I love music like that, but not all the time and yeah. everything. But the stage presence, the happiness the, on stage, I've hardly ever seen that before. It's like, you don't see that with many bands. Huge energy. Yeah, this, yeah. this energy and this, this happy energy, you know, unbelievable. It's like, and, and you see how they work together and everything. And that's really, really beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Jam session on Sunday night. I really enjoyed like the facilitator. Well, I, d I don't even know who she is. Autumn. Autumn, yes. Autumn. I don't know her, but I yeah. thought, man, she, what she does is somehow, it's really amazing. It's fantastic. Yeah, it's yeah. absolutely stunning. Or oh, every single gelato I ate over the weekend, which was <laughs> many, many. <laughs> but every single one was special. <laughs> and, um, oh yeah, it's like I talk to so many people, stall holders. That's what I always do. I go around and talk to the stall holders, see if they firstly need anything. Secondly, make sure that they are happy with everything, how it goes. And, Oh, and the cold my massage I get got over there from the, the massage. Key. Yes, yes, I heard that. Yeah. Yes, that was absolutely stunning. Yeah. Um, What's your, your highlight? Oh, uh, probably the big hug mm. yesterday afternoon. In the, you know, they made this big spiral. Were you there? The spiral, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah, I got really emotional. Sort of felt like if I, you know, let the tears start, they might not stop. Because mm. you, you had, you, you yeah. did have some tears. Yeah yeah, 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 and um, yeah, it's just really special to feel, yeah, there's such a sense of community and family and tribe and sort of, you know, it's like a big tribe of beautiful people, yeah. and, you know, it's just a wonderful feeling of belonging and, yeah. Yeah. and achievement, you know, and, yeah, making it all happen and such a wonderful thing, you know?